the Romans built a 1.6-kilometer drainage tunnel straight through the crater wall of Lake Nemi, a sacred volcanic lake prone to flooding. Around 500 BC, two teams began digging from opposite sides of the hill. The tunnel was so narrow only one person could work at a time. Yet, despite a difference in elevation of just 12 meters, they achieved a consistent gradient of less than 1%. The stakes were high. The Temple of Diana stood on its shores and flooding could threaten this holy site. To set the precise direction for the tunnel, the Romans dug vertical shafts at both ends, not only to guide the teams, but also to ventilate the work and manage excavated debris. At the entrance of the tunnel, they placed a filter, a perforated stone slab to block logs and debris, along with grooves to house sluice gates. These allowed them to control water flow for maintenance or repairs. Today, the emissary is still largely intact, with parts accessible via guided tours. It stands as a remarkable testament to ancient Roman hydraulic mastery.